Patrick is never giving up. What's up, Nero Nation? It's your boy Nero back at it with some more Black Clover news. I I know it's been a while since we had Yuki Tabata back, but he's back with Black Clover and we got his author comment. But before we get into it, I just want to say thank you guys for watching my videos, man. I really appreciate it. Yo, I, I'm trying to get the 10K. You guys can make it happen. If you haven't subscribed, make sure you do it, man. It's crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? It says 43% of you guys that watch the videos ain't subscribed, man. Get involved, man. Go ahead and subscribe for your boy. With that being said, man, let's hop into it. I know y'all like, man, we ain't trying to hear that shit. And I, it's okay. It's cool. It's cool. I can rock with it. But anyway, the uh, Yuki Tabata's author comment for Weekly Shonen Jump, issue number 25. He goes to say, sorry for the absence. The other day I was playing butt sumo with my wife and she easily knocked me down. So strong. <laughs> hey, yo, this dude playing butt sumo with his wife. Hey, hey, look, it sounds like a lot of fun, you know what I'm saying? It also sounds like his wife caked up. It ain't nothing wrong with being caked up, you know what I'm saying? Standing over here caked up. Son, are you okay? But I don't got a sweet tooth. Hello? But I ain't trying to get a cavity. Oh, my God. Hey, look, let me stop talking like that for somebody to be like, Nero, stop. <laughs> stop it. Yo, it's just funny that he actually shares everything with us, yo. Shout out to Yuki Tabata. Like I said, man, he seems like such a, a fun person, man. Like, he would be a, a great person to meet someday. And I'm really curious how his wife feels about him sharing stuff in his weekly uh, weekly comments. Like, yo, she probably like, yo, why would you tell him that? Now my friends know. Why? I could just picture her going off like that, you know. But shout out to Yuki Tabata and his wife having fun playing butt sumo. It sounds like it would be a lot of fun. I mean, it is what it is. It might end a little differently if I was playing it. But, you know, that's a different, that's a whole different conversation. But we're going to keep it moving, man. Also, there's rumors that the Black Clover volume cover for the next volume should be released sometime next week. We don't know for sure, but it's sometime next week. And if it does get released, uh, you could bet I will be doing a video giving my thoughts on how I feel about that volume cover. Let me know down below, like, what do you want to be on this next uh, volume cover? Honestly, for me, I think it's, what is it, volume 34? Is it volume 35? It's volume 35. For me, I really want Noelle to be on the cover after what we got in the latest chapter. Well, the fan translation, the official hasn't dropped yet, of Black Clover. But I know it's too soon for that to be on a volume cover, so I'm guessing that would have to be on volume 36. I, Noelle better be on volume 36. Damn, but then again, they might put Yuno on 36. Matter, matter of fact, I don't know. I really don't know what's going to be on the cover for this uh, next volume because so many things could be up there. Yuno could be up there as well as Asta and the Order 5 headed dragon. Like, there's so many ways he could go. Um, let me know down below what do y'all think the next volume cover is going to, who you think going to be up there. I'm really curious to hear y'all thoughts and, you know what I'm saying, I might actually rock with some of y'all designs, but damn. It's a masterpiece. I, we'll, we'll know next week. We'll know next week. Hopefully, if the rumor is true and we actually get the volume covers, we'll know next week. Next thing on the list, man, the Black Clover mobile game. We have a release date. I know some of y'all like, for real? It says the Black Clover mobile game should be released the 25th of May in Korea and Japan. That's not too far from now. That's just next week. But I know a lot of people are saying like, yo, man, we don't want to know that. We don't know when it's released here. And it says it's rumored to be released on the 29th of June which isn't too far after and I hope that is the case. It seems like Black Clover is getting a lot of things in the month of June. Like it's just gonna be a Black Clover month. I mean, you getting the game release. If this rumor is true, you're getting the game release. You're also getting the novel that comes out on the 9th. The movie comes out on the 16th. The, um, you also got um, the card game supposed to come out on the 2nd. Like you got a lot of things going on for Black Clover in the month of June. And, I'm going to be here covering it all, so make sure you got those notifications turned on. But while we're talking about the Black Clover mobile game, we might as well talk about the uh, the next thing on the list. is They actually show some new outfits for the Black Clover uh, characters within the game. You got Asta, you got Mimosa, and you got Noelle. I, I'm cool with Asta design. I think I've seen that before, as well as the Noelle design. I believe I've seen those two for them to just drop another uh, image of them. But the Mimosa one, that one looks new, and I don't know if I'm a fan of that one. I don't know because my most she just she kind of looks like a, a snitch in this outfit i don't she just looks like the type of girl like oh i shouldn't be doing this he did it like she just seems like the type of person that would tell on you in this outfit she needs to change that outfit that's not the my my, my most i know 
put her back in, the, in her original outfit. I don't like this. I'm not rocking with it. Like she's like gonna be in Paris or something, like drinking tea and eating crumpets. I don't, I don't know. Let me know how y'all feel about these outfits. Which one you like the most? Which one you like the least? And do you agree with me? Like my most of one gotta go. Let me know. I'm really, let me know down below. Next thing on the list while we're talking about Black Clover games, we do got an actual release date for the Black Clover and Marshall uh, card game. It's supposed to be released June 2nd. I said it not too long ago if y'all were paying attention. Were you paying attention? Were you paying attention? Well, yeah, it's supposed to be released on June 2nd. We got a little image of it. And I'm not really sure how this card game is supposed to be, but it is a collab with uh, another magazine, well, another uh, manga. So I think that's going to be dope. Uh, Marshall dope series so far. It's not Black Clover, but you know, I mean, it's all right. It's all right. I'm liking the anime right now. Um, but I definitely will let y'all know more about the game as I find out more details. But as of right now, I just know it's a collab card game. I don't really know how you play it, what's the details of it or anything like that. So stay tuned for that. Uh, if I find out anything, I'll definitely let you guys know. Next thing on the list is something that I think is really dope, man. My Michael B. Jordan is watching Black Clover. I love it. you love to hear especially celebrities like michael b jordan i rock with him you know our names start off the same he's michael b jordan i'm michael b blank i ain't gonna say my last day but you know i'm michael b as well and i think it's pretty dope that he watches black clover it says in this article when asked about recent anime he's watched michael b jordan says he's been enjoying black clover and he also goes to say for me the anime isn't just about the action but the heart that's depicted said the actor so shout out to michael b jordan man yo um and he said this in an interview for the premiere of creed in japan <laughs> So that's dope to know, man. Black Clover, hey, yo, I wonder um, how close is it in his rankings of being like one of his tops? Like, is it up there? I'm pretty sure once he gets to the end of Black Clover, he's gonna be like, yo, that's definitely at the top for me. Black Clover all the way. Also, this month we got the Black Clover movie that's supposed to drop on June 16th. And I really love the fact that they're doing a countdown for the movie with different uh, pictures of different characters for the series. I'm really loving it. I know they dropped the one for the 31 days. I wanna say, yeah, 31 days with Dorothy. That picture looks okay. Let me know, I'm gonna put it on the screen so y'all can see it. The Dorothy one looks pretty dope. 30 days, it has uh, Captain Real. I really like the way Captain Real picture looks like. I don't know, it just looks really good. It looks clean, it looks official, like like some amazing art. I love the Captain Real one for uh, the 30, uh, 30 days away. 29th day is uh, Jack. I like that because, you know, what happened to Jack, we all know. I mean, I feel like Jack should have a major moment in the movie. I'm not saying Jack's the best, but his uh, picture is the best, but it's a pretty dope picture, man. Hopefully you guys like it. And for the 28th day, which is today, we got uh, Charlotte. And Charlotte one looks dope as well, but like I said, I would say Captain Real is the best, then Charlotte's, followed by Jack, and then Dorothy last. So far, uh, by the time you're seeing this video, the 20, it'll be the 27th day before the movie release. And there'll be a new uh, picture out. If y'all want me to continue to show the pictures on the, as the on the path to the countdown, let me know, and I will, you know, post it in the community tab like I did today for the Charlotte one. But Leo, I am liking these pictures, and I think it's dope that they're actually doing a countdown for the picture for the days of the Black Clover. It just, honestly, it's really just making me want the movie more and more. It does. I mean, honestly, I'm gonna keep it 100 with y'all. Next thing on the list, and while we're talking about the movie, um, they're also releasing these uh, three-dimensional. Uh, stands of seven different uh characters from the black clover movie and i'm not gonna lie these junks look pretty dope why can't they release this type of stuff here because i would get all seven hold on let me make sure let me look at every character maybe not the Pagolion one he, he's been disappointing me. but i would get all well i'll get six out of the seven and i would have them all back here like these things look clean maybe somebody will be selling them on on ebay or something but you got uh sis lion looking dope you got Pagolion. i don't really like the way Pagolion outfit is looking like did his outfit always look like that man it just it doesn't look right man i don't know Pagolion outfit ain't looking good man you got nazelle he looks good uh you got yami you got yuno asta and noel all of theirs look good it's just the Pagolion one the, the drip he wearing ain't dripping you know so maybe it's just me it's just eh, to get that out of here but i really like these and i would love to have them man but they actually come out on the 16th that it says it's going to be giving away like a lottery pool so man a web lottery actually Man, I wish I could get those, man. Those look really clean. Let me know how y'all feel about them and which one y'all think y'all favorite y'all favorite is. For me, if I had to pick a favorite, 
I hate to say it, man. It'll be between Sis Lion and Yunos. I think theirs are the best ones, man. Then maybe Asta and Yami, followed by Noel, Mazel, then Fagolian. But yeah, that that uh, Sis Lion and Yuno one looks really clean. I really would love to get that. Man, let me know y'all thoughts. Which one y'all think is the best, man? I'm really curious to hear y'all thoughts on it. And happy birthday to the voice actor of Nazelle. He does some other characters as well. Oh man, he does the Sparta dude. I can't think of his name, but he had one. He had one of the greatest speeches said to him by the captain that defeated him um, from Bleach. I really love that speech. So whenever I see him, I feel like he's a character I'm always going to remember. You got Kiba up there. Like, okay, you got some JoJo character up there. Oh, and the latest uh, villain in Demon Slayer. I can't think of. Uh, which which upper rank number he actually is but anyway you got he got a couple voices up here uh let me know which voice stand out to you the most for me it would be nazelle i think nazelle voice is pretty uh dope and happy birthday to him hopefully he had a great birthday and he did some fun things uh, with that being said that's pretty much everything we got for the black clover news video this week uh let me know what news stood out to you the most that you enjoy hearing about the most um was it about the game release date possibly in the states on the 29th of june was it the new figures or stands they got for the movie i really want one of those stands was it yuki tabata's author comment was it the new clothes we got to see for the game was it the card game release date as well like let me know down below what stood out to you the most and what did you enjoy hearing the most let me know down below and hopefully you guys like this video if you did make sure you thumb it up subscribe hit the bell for all notifications hoping you have a great day and night wherever you are this your boy Nero Mega Man signing out peace